Hi everyone, welcome to Prison Stress Kitchen. I hope you guys are doing great. Guys, if you are joining me for the first time, I want to welcome you. And to all my lovely subscribers on YouTube, I want to thank you. And those following me on Facebook, I want to thank you and welcome you as well. Today we are making condensed milk cake. This are no machine needed. It's very simple. So let me take you through what I have today. I have nine eggs. I have one tablespoon of nutmeg, one tablespoon full of um, lemon juice, or you can use lime. And this is one and a half cups of condensed milk. And this is one and a half cups of sunflower oil. If you don't want sunflower oil, you can use your margarine or your butter. It's all going to work for you. I have vanilla extract and I have three cups of self-raising flour. That's the one I have here. And I have my bowl that I'll be mixing in it. So let's do this together. In my clean bowl, I'll start by pouring all the eggs in that bowl and I'll whisk till it becomes smooth and clear and nice. I'm gonna add my condensed milk to it and make sure you scoop all the condensed milk from your bowl and add to your eggs. Now, um, for better results, make sure you measure, if you're using oil, use your cup to measure the oil first before you measure the condensed milk. That way the condensed will not stick in the, in the bowl or the cup that you're gonna use to measure the condensed milk it will be so easy to just come out from the bowl straight up now I added my oil and my lemon juice so I'm gonna add my vanilla extract I'm taking one and half tablespoon after adding make sure you whisk together with your other ingredients now I got myself some um, strainer so I added the nutmeg and added my flour this is self raising flour this one has baking powder and um, salt already so I, I did not add any baking powder but if you're using all-purpose flour then you have to add baking powder about one teaspoon the small spoon and you add some salt to it as well so now all that I'm going to do is um, I'm going to mix the flour with my other ingredients and you have to make sure it becomes smooth no lumps make sure you don't have any lumps in it you want it to be smooth this is quick and easy the kids are home so you can do this for them in the afternoon or in the evening you know sweet after meals yeah so whether you a husband taking care of the children at home whether you a brother a nephew you can just do this and it will be so perfect for you guys now i've greased my pan with some oil you can grease with margarine butter oil whatever you want and you add your before you add your mixture to the cake pan now after I'm done doing this I'm gonna go ahead and um, tap my mixture on the counter to bring all the air or some of the air out of it before it goes in the oven I don't know if you guys can see some small bubbles there I want those bubbles to come out before it goes in the oven while I was doing this I preheated the oven at 300 degrees Celsius so now it's gonna go in the oven for one hour and after one hour this is the cake welcome from the oven mm-hmm now this is the result that we are looking for it's so nice now you can just use your spatula just to um, make it easier when you want to bring it out you know so guys obviously we are done with the video we've come to the end of the video 
I hope you find this so easy and simple to do. The kids are home. Just do this for them and they're going to love it. You don't need any machine. You can just buy condensed milk and you just do this for the family. While you are watching the movie, then you eat this together. Guys, if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, please kindly do so. Give me likes. Share this on your wall. If you want me to do more, give me positive comments to push me to do more delicious recipes for you guys. Guys, until then, I will see you another time. Stay blessed and give it a try.